So PV Sindhu is now just one win away from winning an Olympic medal in the quarter final of the women's singles in Rio. Sindhu beat world number two Wang Yihan in a grueling match. She now plays Nozomi Okuhara of Japan for a place in the final. The hope to win a medal is not over yet. When more than half the Indian contingent has left the battleground, one Hyderabad lass has taken the honours on her shoulders to make her presence felt. PV Sindhu has given hope to the nation that till she's in Rio, there is hope. Sindhu stayed calmer and then she was aggressive in the last few points to finish it off. So, all in all, I think uh, great game by Sindhu. I think uh, very good attitude and uh, good to see her uh, perform at the high stage. Sindhu upset the bookmakers and beat world number two Wang Yihan in a tough match in Rio. In a match that lasted 54 minutes, Sindhu came up on top. It's been a perfect campaign for Sindhu so far. She beat Laura Sarosi in her first match. Sindhu did face resistance against Michelle Lee in her second group match. But in the knockout stage, Sindhu found her feet. In the round of 16, she completely dominated world number eight Tai Zhu Ying. And in the semi-final, she faced world number two Wang Yihan and beat her 22-20, 21-19. Uh, before that, I just uh, look at her matches or you know mm. how she's playing and what's uh, what's her weak point. Mm. So I just look at it and discuss with my coach and play accordingly. So mm. that's how I, I play uh, with each opponent because it's, it's a different style of play with everybody. Badminton was always one of the sports that promised to deliver. With Saina Nehwal out early, the honours was on Sindhu to deliver. The mission is not over yet as Sindhu still has to win at least one more match against her Japanese opponent in the semi-final. And if that's accomplished, Sindhu can dream of gold. Sports Bureau, India Today. Tripti, what a great show by PV Sindhu, isn't it? We were talking about this in the build-up of this match and uh, we always knew that Sindhu can do this. Uh, but what great show of nerves that to pulling it off in straight games. Absolutely, Shivani. Uh, it was a brilliant show by Sindhu. And uh, as, I, as I said, you know, earlier that uh, this entire tournament she's been doing well. She's been uh, very calm and mm -hmm. composed. And uh, especially in this match, we saw her coming in confidently and uh, with a killer attitude, which was uh, very much required. Mm -hmm. And uh, I mean, when, when they started the first game, it started off with uh, such a high pace. Uh, both both of them were going on attacking uh, and we could clearly see that whoever was doing a good attack was uh, in the command of that particular game. Right. Borea has and this invigorated uh, the remaining contingent in Rio. Uh, this could be the toughest uh, battle that she would face. Of course, uh, not to you know underplay uh, Okuhora's uh, challenge in the semi-finals. She's after all an All-England champion this year. But uh, clearly, uh, all going to plan. All going to plan, Shivani. Actually, no one, none of us want to sort of say, the, you know, shoot our mouth again. Because mm -hmm. we've done that with Abhina, we've done that with Sanya Rohan. We are just sort of, you know, on the edge, you know, one more. And then we will all sort of outburst will happen. But after the match, uh, Sindhu uh, looked very composed. We had a brief chat, in fact, a fairly, fairly detailed chat when she was walking out with Gopi and we were all waiting there. She was very calm. She kept saying one more, one more. She's confident. She's calm. 18th, 9.20 in the morning, entire Indian contingent will be at the Rio Centro for to cheer for Shin Sindhu. That you said grueling at the start. It was a brutal encounter. You know, Yihan Wang gave it everything. Come back from 18.13, 19.18 lead. And then to close that out takes a lot of guts takes a lot of heart, takes a lot of passion and determination. Tremendous. Ab absolutely. Viren, uh, what do you have to say about Sindhu's performance? Uh, this was always going to be a stiff challenge, world number two, nonetheless. Today was a performance of courage, grit, under huge pressure. I think this was Sindhu's best of ever performance. Mm. I tweeted yesterday when Sindhu beat Taizu Ying that that was the best I've ever seen her play. But today's performance against world number two Wang Yihan supersede, superseded even yesterday's performance. I mean, so much composure under pressure, 
the execution was brilliant and sindhu was just fantastic i mean this is the big stage the olympics quarter finals in your debut olympics it is not easy to take that kind of pressure against the the world number 2 the reigning olympic silver medalist and sindhu was just fantastic today i mean all credit to her all credit to her coach gopi chand sindhu has been in tremendous form and fitness throughout this tournament and uh, uh, she uh, she performed today in a way that has made all indians really really proud right trupti looking forward just a little bit uh, of course yihan wang is more illustrious and she is more known but okuhura is also going to be a very stiff challenge isn't it she's risen very fast she's number 6 higher ranked than sindhu and holds a 3-1 head to head against sindhu all in recent years in the last 3 years so would you say that the next match could be as tough or if not tougher uh well shivani uh, uh, the best part in this olympics uh, especially in the women singles is uh, the top 10 ranked uh, are capable i mean rather they were capable of uh, winning a gold in any one out of them was capable of winning the gold so uh, i mean i treat all of them uh, uh, at par hmm. so uh, so considering that let's not take uh, naomi okuhara again uh, saying that uh, she is a weaker opponent compared uh, to the other uh, players hmm. uh, as you said you know the, she has won the all england and her head to head is uh, definitely higher uh, to sindhu so uh, basically sindhu will have to uh, be ready for <coughs> sorry sindhu will have to be ready for the long rallies uh, which is uh, her strength naomi is and hmm. uh, she will have to uh, mix up with good attack and some deceptive deceptive strokes right Borya did Sindhu say anything in particular about her next match? <coughs> you know when uh, Sindhu's match was done uh, Shivani Okuhara had was uh, still on. Hmm. In fact at that point in time Yamaguchi had won the first game but I spoke to Gopi and Sindhu about 15 20 minutes back and Gopi to quote said she's a gritty rally player. So we've got to engage her into rallies and Sindhu will have to be patient at the same time aggressive. Gopi is now sort of tending to Shrikant because of the match tomorrow morning and after that will once again focus back on Sindhu but make no mistake this whole head to head etc is going out of the window it's all on the day it's all on the day and this girl is rising like a phoenix she's confident she's calm she's composed she's doing it day in day out hopefully fingers crossed Shivani one more day and it'll either be a silver or a gold we so desperately want that Viren what impressed you the most about Sindhu's game plan the way she played something that you know gives us confidence for the next match as well I think the best thing about Sindhu has really been uh, 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 her sharpness of her all court play uh, uh, she she she's really developed some delicate drop shots she was ready for the uh, long rallies today against Wang Yihan she said so in the press conference after the game as well that she had come uh, prepared for a long match and uh, you know normally in in these big tough matches when Sindhu tends to lose three or four points she tends to lose concentration she mm. tends to lose focus she gets a bit irritated but none of that was was seen today she was focused composed kept the pressure on wang yihan until the very end and her superior fitness really told in fact it was wang yihan who who looked really weary and tired towards the ending of the game overall a right. brilliant We performance by pv sindhu We said that yesterday Sindhu definitely has big match and big tournament presence. Remember she's beaten the top 3 Chinese players over the last 3 years in world championships uh, and now she's doing it at the Olympic stage as well. <laughs>